Oh, that's that's interesting. Good read. Oh, handgun ammo. I'm more excited about that than the read. I'm trying to remember. Oh, this room. That guy is special. He has the key to the lock, the door behind him, which leads to the next room. After this, you could walk around. Or you could just do that. It's it's actually slower, I believe, to jump through the window, but it's far far cooler. So the the red guy, if you he uh, he can be killed before he he, he runs uh, around you, and he runs to the center down there because there's a uh, Gatling gun in the middle of that area, which he will get into if you don't kill him before he gets to there. But if you do, you save yourself some hassle, and thankfully I do. I, I don't get to show off the Gatling gun, unfortunately, for you folks, but I think the fact that I, I got him beforehand is uh, cool enough in its own right. So just kind of mow down some dudes on the way there. The thing is, he doesn't, um, he doesn't run. Whoa, that was close. And that was too close. He doesn't start running away until you actually aim at him. So I don't know. Yeah, he's he's not. I might be able to throw a grenade in there and stun him, perhaps. I'm not sure. I don't, I don't know. I go try that. Yeah, I try that. What am I doing? All right. Yeah, this is probably not the most guaranteed strategy, but. I haven't aimed a gun at him, so he's not running away. So I throw that and I stun him. Oh, come on. Oh, he fell down. That's good. Yeah, he would be running along there, but I kind of glitched the game just a tad. I get close. There we go. I, I have to do that or else he'll get back up and run. So, might as well reload. Take this time too. Yeah, I got him. I totally got him. He takes a lot of damage, though, unfortunately. Now, the whole thing is, he's supposed to get in the Gatling gun, and you're supposed to snipe him out of it. But, eh, you could snipe him when he's along that path or whatever, but if you do it fast enough, like I did, or well enough, or oddly enough, then you're settled. You're gold. And there's a couple more grunts to clean up. And there's a lot of jars down there. I didn't get them earlier because he may have started to run away and I may have had to do the Gatling battle, which is sort of a mini boss, which I don't like to do. It's a good uh, ammo and a good 4,000 pesos, which is nice. And now I'm uh, free to uh, just get that stuff then. So let's go get the free money. I can't fall down. I dang it all. I danged it. I danged all the things. So unfortunately, this part's gonna lag on just a tad. But hey, you know, uh, we're gonna get money. Bam. Nice. Your nerves is nice. The uh, Gatling gun would have obviously mowed these down as you were walking along, so that would have been easier, you know, and do all that. But you'd still have to fight the dude. If you did, uh, if you let him or couldn't get to him in time, and he got in the Gatling gun, and you then you kill him, his uh, the key would actually be on one of the sides there, and you'd be able to, you'd still be able to get to it, obviously, or else the game would be broken, and you'd never be able to complete unless you were good enough. Which is kind of the thing about video games, really. You can't beat it unless you're good enough. So, shotgun. Might as well reload it. It's kind of useful. Let's take this uh, minute to just reload my... Nine uh, TMP bullets isn't too fantastic. Well, it's it, it's quite nice because it's, it's nine damage, which is about my sniper rifle right now, I think. But... It's 
It's a hundred bullets a clip, so it's kind of like whatever. Yeah, there's where he would have came up from. In a Gatling gun. Machine gun. So we just enter the key and go into the gallery. Which is a small puzzle. By the way, that goat thing over here has... It just reminds me of uh, Evil Dead 2. I think I like that. Look at that uh, deer. Busting some pots for some delicious monies. And this puzzle. Uh, the quick solution is... I think I looked it up. Maybe I this. I remember. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is just a uh, swatch for the quick solution, which is four and two, I think. No. Oh, there you go. You have to get six uh, hang hung men there, so... There's a way to do it. It's not a difficult puzzle at all. Not at all. But you get through and... What a pleasant surprise. But I'm afraid it's Ashley we need. Not you, Mr. Kennedy. If you don't need me, then get off my back, old man. <gasps> Did you say old man, Mr. Kennedy? It might come as a surprise. But I'm only 20 years old. So you're just like all the others? A puppet of the parasites? Surely you don't think I'm the same as those diminutive ganados. The parasites, las plagas, are slaves to my will. I have absolute control. Well, I really don't give a damn. Rain or shine, you're going down. Get rid of our American friend. Well, we're locked in with the gauntlet of dudes. That last bit of the scene, I have to admit, the scene seems... To me, it's fairly unfamiliar. Just because I'm so used to this area. And when I think of this area, I think about this top area because that's where I spend almost, that's where you spend almost all the time in this area. But, uh, yeah, deactivate the security to do that and allows you to press another switch and knock your graft, hopefully. Yeah, you want to watch out for that painting. Because rocket launchers hurt bad. And I believe... Uh, if you're not at full health, a rock launcher will kill you, so... It'll just bring you to almost dead. Yeah, he's going here. And that pot is a decoy. Actually holds a switch to extend the bridge. Yeah, the, the place in the, the last part of the scene... Also, quick note, these guys have rock launchers. Just uh, back up, and they'll use it. And then, <laughs> funny enough, they'll just be standing there with nothing to do. The last bit of that scene where the camera was all like tilted and going to whoa trippy. I'm not used to that area. I don't remember that area. It looks so familiar. It looks like it's not part of the game. Just because this area, I'm used to the top area, which you don't see the bottom area, and it changes because of the middle piece there and the bridge. So it just doesn't look as it did in the scene. So it's it changes so fast. The, the scenery, it's, it just changes scenery so fast, and it changes the scenery. So, and you kill those guys, and another group spawns. I don't know if another group spawns after that group, but I'm just gonna snipe this, these guys. Now I was lucky enough to actually have a small crowd of people follow me, and the uh, the rocket launchers actually blow them up and uh, help me out. Don't. Some more ammo. I get more ammo than I spent on him, which is always lovely. Yeah. There's, uh, this should be the last crowd. Oh, these guys don't look too happy. They're like, oh man. Yeah, th this should be the last wave of archers. I'm just gonna get in here for a second and recoup, reload. They should come to the door and open the door to try to snipe me. I don't think that happens though. They just shoot at the door. 
So yeah, that's uh. I was gonna say something beforehand, but I forgot. Yeah, there's there's actually a uh, little oil lamps up above each corner that you can use if you uh, can. This area I came in through, so it's nothing. Guy ran away just to start walking towards me. What is this? TMP is not that great of a mid to long range weapon. Understandable. There's a bit of ammo to my left there. Yep. Or spindle, rather. It's even better, actually. I think there's ammo over here. Ah, oh, shoot, the, shoot the pot. Yeah. Nice. That should kill him. Yep. Might as well get his stuff. And might as well loot the lower area. Just for extra cash. Because it's, it's, it's nice to have extra cash in this game. As well as not die. By, uh... Random dudes. Oh, that was close. Too close. Too spooky for me. <laughs> it's posing the, the thing on the way, guy. Oh wow. Yeah, I don't. You don't want to get hit with the scythe. Whether or not it actually instant kills you is, is regardless of the fact that you just don't want to get hit by. It. Nobody wants to get hit in the face with a scythe, except really messed up people. And those kind of people probably should be hit in the face with the scythe if they really want it. But that's that. We can. I think we're free to just get the medallion piece. I think it is. I don't know. The piece of the puzzle. Literally. Ornament. Okay. Let's get the goat. We got the goat. Let's uh, get out of here then. We get to go. I'm trying to make a joke there, but I can't. I'm sorry. Story of my life. I'm trying to make a joke, but I can't. I'm sorry. A dreary story. A very. getting fairly close to the end of this actual record. Not. Actually, not getting close to the end of almost anything, really. We're probably... I don't know. We're still, oh, say about a fourth of the way through the castle area now. You can actually kill those birds. Get a little bit of a experience. Or, not experience. This is another RPG. Well, it has RPG elements with uh, upgrading other guns, sort of, so... But not really. A flash grenade can kill, as you saw at the El Gigante area before the fight, kill birds. And there's a small fountain over here. And I think the flash grenade sells for 500 uh, pesos. Percentos. But, and we already made it back. Very nice. Very nice. Not bad. Not bad. It's actually, uh... What am I doing... Okay. Um, yeah, this area over there will be back. We'll be back here. This little uh, little alley thing here. There's actually some birds up uh, above that you can kill. I didn't know this until uh, much later when I played through this on uh, my pro mode version. My my pro and not it's not even quotations. Actually, the uh, pro difficulty. Yeah, there's some birds up there somewhere. Yeah, you can get, there's the difficulty pro, which is hard difficulty. And it has a hard difficulty pro mode, as is what it's called. It has a special weapon when you unlock, when you beat it. Which is pretty overpowering. But first, a couple scenes and a couple maze adventures. That should be good. Mr. Kennedy. Still alive, I see. So, do you like my garden? I see you've managed to work in a little of your twisted taste here, too. <laughs> Sagacious as I am. Even I get lost here sometimes. Even if it takes your whole life, you'll never get out. Do you know that no one dies without a cause? You will satisfy the stomachs of my cute pets. Now, if you'll excuse me, I have to tie up a few loose ends. 
Like chasing down a couple of rats. Two rats? If one's Lewis, who's the other? Huh. They're an intruder besides me? Well, you see, Leon, a couple doesn't always mean two. A, a couple could be, oh, I have a couple eggs in this curtain, and you have, like, four or five eggs. A couple doesn't always mean an actual couple. You know, as in, oh, they make it such a cute couple. I don't know, it's... It's kind of... If it, yeah, I, I just, I don't know. A couple doesn't always mean two, so it leans all like, it's two? Anyways, this maze is annoying, and it's best to have a map up on another screen. And guard dogs, so be sure to have uh, your shotgun ready to knock them down. Now, this maze, there's ammo, there's some health, there's a first aid spray somewhere in the maze. But I'm only going to get if I could try. Should have bought. I should have bought that treasure map. Uh, I'm going to try to get the uh, the treasure, the actual treasure deal, which is another one of those uh, gems for the mask. And sorry about that. The mask. I can't see. I think I heard a car. Uh, for the mask, there is the red gem. Stretching. And. Uh, I think I might get the first aid kit. I don't remember, actually. Come to think to it. Yeah, but there's, there's random dogs. Whenever you get a uh, treasure chest. Ugh. Whenever you get a treasure chest, which holds an item, whether it be shotgun shells or uh, first aid spray or an actual treasure. They will uh, pop out of nowhere and try to attack you. There's a couple over there. I'm going to see if I can try to snipe them through the bars, which doesn't work out too well, I think. I got one, but apparently through the bars just hits the bars. So, let's just sit and wait. Doesn't take them long to get up here. I have the distinct advantage. Oh, they must have got hit by the bullet or something, because one shotgun shell took them down. Hmm. So we got one piece. Hey, oh, hey, oh. Uh. Time to travel the seas and uh, as a pirate. We need the other piece, which should be just around a couple corners. Yes. Over the bridge. And. There. Uh, to, to the left, I think, is just like a first aid. Not a first If it was a first aid, I'd get it. It's just like shotgun shells, so it's whatever. Oh, almost didn't notice that guy. Yeah, I'm just gonna run. Because you can just jump down here. This is the advised, um, order to get the stuff, because that... Now, these, can, these guys can open doors, which I don't think they could have, uh, pre in the previous game. Uh, PlayStation 2 version, at least, which is uh, interesting. To say the most. So, ammo. That's good, at least. I mean, get out of here. Gotta reload. This gun, I, I don't care about reloading and losing the shells for. Now, I don't think we can put these together. I think we can. Yeah, we can just put them together. Alright, well, there you go. Solve that. Let's get in here and uh, get out of here. Get out of this maze place. Put your hands where I can see them. Sorry, but following a lady's lead just isn't my style. Put them up now. Advice, try using knives next time. Works better for close encounters. Leon. Long time no see. 
Ada. So it is true. True? About what? You, working with Wesker. I see you've been doing your homework. Why, Ada? What's it to you? Why are you here? Why'd you show up like this? <laughs> See you around. Ada! Ada, wait. So that's the end of that section. We're in a new chapter. My least favorite cha One of my least... My least favorite chapter, I will say it. I'll just save over this. There is... Uh, almost the end of this recording session, actually. Just, uh, there's a couple barrel, uh, barrel, there's a couple pots around. There's, uh, some things to get, merchant to talk to, but we'll do that later. In the next part. Maybe. Maybe we'll do it now. Let's see. Still probably, there's still a couple minutes left. There's a couple grenades. I think only one. Ammo, there's actually, switch to, at least ammo consumption. A uh, bit of a treasure up here that we can get. Spindle. Yeah, so, uh, how about that? Ada, wait. That's a big reveal. So, that must have been the other rat that was with Luis. Or was it? Yeah, it was. <laughs> so, in this cute little room is some treasure, which I'm sure... I wonder why the merchant didn't just swipe it. Swiping or no swiping. Instead of just leaving it there for us to get. Check out that file in a moment. Right now, female, and it's talking about Ada. Now, if you remember back in the day when we were being shangled by the big cheese because he told us not to follow us, and then we initiated in the optional scene, which is not optional. Well, it is optional, it's actually a canon scene because of a thing later. I might as well just put that in the mask now. Let's man see what the what we got upgrades and stuff. What are you selling? Let's go down here. We should have. Oh, I'm gonna sell it. So I sell one of those grenades. I don't need that many. Not really. The mirror and pearls is not combined. So, and uh, you, you can get a lot of green cat's eyes and a couple of red eyes. Sell all but one because you'll have plenty. And there's not really any upgrades. Is that old yeah, no, I don't know. Probably not. Maybe. I don't know. Is that Definitely getting that, because that was actually helpful. Would have been helpful earlier, but that's it for now. See you in the next series of parts. Have a good day. Slay lots of zombies. And not zombies.